my name is Jess Bennett and I'm an AST at Riverside Primary School. Our project is the TALK project, which is an acronym Talking and Language for Kids. And our project was a cluster collaborative approach. We worked with West Launceston, Trevallon Primary and Riverside Primary and all of our prep teachers had the opportunity to participate in the project that was an interprofessional collaboration with our speech and language pathologist, Sally O'Donnell. As a team, we worked together to build upon our skills in speech and language so that we could take students' speech and language goals that were developed by the speech and language pathologist and actually be able to action those goals more effectively in the classroom. We've been really aspirational in our approach to the project. It's something different and it's something new and I suppose we've been really courageous in how we've tackled it. Our project's been really student focused. So while uh, all of the professional learning of course has taken place as a, a space learning model working in teams, we've always had the students first and foremost. I'm Carol Stingle, Principal of Bridport Primary School. Reading is at the basis of everything we learn, whether it's maths, whether it's researching, if they want to use technology. So a large part of our focus here has been improving the reading skills of the students so that when they leave here, they'll have those skills to continue to learn for life. We live the department's values every day. We take risks and we model to the children that having courage to learn is a really critical part of the learning process. High expectations, that's about aspiration and wanting every student to do their best. And most importantly is that notion of respect. Relationships is the foundation of learning and it's something that we've worked really hard to build a culture of respect here in which the learning is then embedded. I just think we are moulding children's lives in our hands and it's so important that we provide every student within this school the best opportunity to learn, to grow and achieve success. And so I do come to school every day determined that we're going to make a difference and that they're going to achieve and be the best people that they can be as well. My name is Katrina Hutchinson, I work at Claremont College and I am the literacy coach here. We put together a program that goes for 30 weeks and in each of those weeks they do six particular types of activities that are developmentally sequenced. They share a community of learning within our space and at the end of those 30 weeks we test them again and they are absolutely thrilled with their improvement. These students show a lot of courage. They are very, very vulnerable. They've been hiding their lack of skill for a number of years. There's nowhere to hide in our groups. They need to own their skill or lack of it and work on it. What's really inspirational for me is for the kids that when we start the year, it's, I can't do this. And then halfway through the year, it's, I am doing this. And by the end of the year, not only do they see themselves as being a literate person, but they see themselves as being a learner. And for me, that's so important because their life ahead of them is about continual learning. That is their future. <laughs>